gear is not bad and and reviews are not bad reviews are actually great he, here's what i'm proposing <laughs> As usual, I gotta head to the office. But Hello. All right, it's an amazing morning down here. First, I just wanna say hello to all the new subscribers here. I didn't realize that yesterday's video was gonna uh, resonate with so many of you. And because it does, and you guys left some pretty amazing comments, I just wanted to clear a few things up. I don't want you to think that I hate gear or reviews. I actually love gear. I just get tired of watching the relentless reviews of cameras that pretty much do more or less the exact same thing. going to pull a Tepa Hopoya and fly off this dock with my one wheel. <sighs> I've got nowhere to set my camera on down here. So I'm way more interested in cameras or gear that allow me to get shots that I couldn't otherwise without them. Like iPhones, 360 cameras, action cameras, things of this nature, and even something as simple as this. I'm on an active road right now, so I gotta make sure I don't get hit. This is an extra long selfie pole, an extended selfie stick, if you will. And that allows me to take my 360 camera and put it three meters in the air, giving me effectively drone-like shots. This is a really cool piece of gear. And I mean, like, look at these shots. Here, I'll do a, I'll do a quick one right here. And the best part is, is when you have a stick this big, you go from being the nerd who's walking around like this to everyone being like, what the hell is that thing? Like, cause it's so massive. It's so out of place. That's one of those 360 things? Yeah. I often wondered where, how's this guy filming this? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Man. Yeah. So are you, are you testing the product? Or you... This one in particular is built extremely well. And I love that you can actually adjust it to all of these different spots. You've got 120 centimeters, 240, 300. It's just way more versatile. So you can still have the, the dorky selfie stick or you can extend it all the way out for the massive winner. Days like today where it's freezing outside, this, uh, this little foamy handle makes all the difference. The only other way you can achieve these types of shots is with an FPV drone. And I'm definitely not allowed to do that here. Your creator kit should be made up only of the essentials. Things that you use every single day that makes it easier to tell the stories that you want. Plus, you gotta admit, there's something pretty cool about having this selfie pool. Gear is not bad. R reviews are not bad. But what I'm proposing here or pledging is that I will only review gear that I personally use. It will only be on this channel if I believe it helps or it's a complete and utter disaster. <laughs> 
I will have a practical reason for choosing to upgrade or buying it. It either makes things easier or adds visually in a way that other gear couldn't achieve. In fact, here's a good video that I think gives you an idea of what this specific camera looks like in action. It's an old vlog I made on the Sony ZV-1, and I think, uh, I think you'll really enjoy it. So I'll see you over there, and I'm curious to hear what you think.